Hey, what's going on everybody? Skoda Gaming here. Thank you very much for joining us. As you can see, we are back. We're playing some Oxen 3 and we're heading to the woods to try and save Ren. Off we go. Uh, for those of you who don't know Oxen 3, it's a game that came out fairly recently on Steam. It's getting some very, very good reviews. I have to say, I am enjoying it. It's uh, drawn me in with the story. Although we haven't got that far I, into the story. I um, didn't realize just how much woods there were. This is like a, like a genuine forest. What's the matter? Not the outdoorsy type? Well, if it's in a city with concrete and a little open all-night pancake place, then yeah, I'm outdoorsy in that I'm outdoors. But I just want to make sure, you know, that we know where we're going. We... Um, vaguely. Does that help? Uh, yeah, no, anyway, this, know, this, this game has really drawn really me cool. in. It reminds me of a park woods I guess near where I used to live it's really kind of felt just like this it's weird oh yeah what was that one called Peabody I think I'm trying to remember the sign but like half the letters had fallen off so it spelled pea pork my dad was really happy to move here you know he said the schools were safer less knifings per capita I guess he never considered the danger of whatever's happening right now but, you know, everything's got something. Yeah, we once had a mall Santa who was kidnapping kids. I think that's been so far the scariest thing that's happened. Well, I mean, to be fair, that does sound pretty scary. It's down here. Nothing. Let's get our little radio out. is this so this is the main I guess the main context so far of the story that you have a radio on an island where there are no radio signals and your radio picks up all sorts of weird going on and this is one of those this thing's so weird looking apparently it's 400 years old there's a cafe in town named after it. And next, on the tour of Edwards Island, an old bush. Well, I think this stuff is interesting. It's four centuries old. You're not impressed by that? It's a tree, so not really. No. Yeah, understandable. It's a tree. Right, let's go. We're going to move on. Um, as I said before, this doesn't really, uh, doesn't really lend itself to a fantastic Let's Play, but um, I wanted to bring it to you. If you're enjoying it, then please let me know in the comments, and it'll uh, I'll make sure I continue to bring you some more of it. Um, if not, I will probably play it in my own time. Off we go. We're heading. We're going to run to Ren. You know what? We've been walking for far too long. Let's run to him. I don't know what way I'm going. I'm going to head this way. Are oh, you just going to climb up there? Are you? Oh, I don't want to go back to the woods. I'm going to come with you. I've changed my mind. Oh, now you jump up there. Up we go. Oh, stuck. Now what way are we going? Should we jump across? Um, why is there a cable car here? Couldn't they have just made, like, just like a normal bridge? Yeah, it's kind of neat, right? It's like going on a gondola ride. I don't know if I'd say it's neat. It looks less than welcoming. Or at least it <gasps> what we've got here. inviting. Or... Look, it's a little scary, but Ren needs us, so... Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. All right, well, let's just see if we got to take the um, conveyor thing. It's been running here since the invention of ovens. If indeed you find fault with anything or expose it with charity, the abbot shall discuss it prudently. What in the world is going on? 99.9 .9 is where we were. Is there anything else? Shall 
Right, okay. Oh, check out the small cemetery in the Pacific Northwest. Literally, it's from the 1800s. Jesus, I thought that was a pet cemetery. I'm kind of relieved this island's depressing enough. So I'm assuming I've done what I need to do here. I've listened to the... The control is vibrating quite... Quite a lot. Or expose it. With charity, the abbot shall discuss it prudently. Lest perchance God has sent him for this very thing. Alright, let's head on. Let's put the radio away and let's get going. I've got to jump up here. Right, now what way are we going here? One of these ways takes us to uh to our boy. We're gonna head this way, I guess. Or do I keep going up? Is that where the cable car is? Oh, there's more rocks, look. Oh, we could have gone in there. Intriguing. Let's go towards these rocks. I want to know what's going on with the rocks, first of all. Glad we, uh, glad we got to the bottom of that, Bubbly Dunbar. Okay, we might as well head into this little, little hut and see if there's something of interest here, I suppose. Hopefully it's not too scary. And then we'll try and send Jonas over that bridge first. Right, here we go. Power transfer station 167. Okay, that's a little strange. Why wouldn't they lock it? I mean, somebody should have locked it, right? Uh, maybe there's no need? Like there's nothing here to steal or something? Right. TV. Can we watch I'll TV? That just because... What else am I going to do? Being terrorized on an island by unseen forces really makes you miss television. Well, maybe if we get the power working, you can catch up on the soaps. Good idea. I like his thinking. Anything else? I found the circuit breaker. Wait, like the first thing it says is beware of overload. Do not attempt restart without supervision. Um, so I don't know. Just let me do it. That way, if something bad happens... You know. That's very sweet. <laughs> really, but I'm not the type of sister you need to throw your coat on the puddle for, okay? Okay. It's your barbecue. Here goes nothing. Uh, what did you flip? Because it kind of did the opposite of what we wanted. I flipped the... Uh, it's the only one, Jonas. What other switch could I even flip? Oh, good point. The lamp's flickering. Do you think it's like on backup power now or something? We might have just broken it. Ever think of that? I did think of that, but it's not like it's our fault the door slammed shut, so I don't know. Some what the hell? That's... That's... God, I haven't heard this in forever. This is something my mom used to... I am so tired of this funhouse bullcrap. Wow. Oh, 
Are we good to go? Are we good to go? Hello? Oh, look, the door's open for us. Yay. I don't want to know what was outside the hut. We're just going to push on. There's a chair. Uh, was that there before? Alex? Are you all right? Alex! <laughs> Not nice. Funny. Not funny. Nice. Opposite. Total opposite of fun. It was worth it. Why is there a chair? Anyone care to explain? <sighs> what a night. Huh? <sighs> yeah. Tonight's not exactly what I expected. Um, what does that mean? You said, what a night. I was just... I'm just saying, this this isn't anybody's fault, you know. Humming Here we go. Barracuda. Barracudas don't hum. Well, this one is. Get on board, sunshine. Praise the Lord. Off we go. Oh. Oh. And I guess... We'll call it the end of the episode there. Thank you very much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe button. Follow us on Twitter at Scott Gaming. We'll see you again soon. Thank you.